and as you probably noticed, I did bring a little friend along to help me out today. I'm going to need all the help I can get because we've got a big show in store for you today. Are you ready to see some birds? Yeah! yeah. yeah. Excellent. I love the enthusiasm over here. You're in luck, my friends. Did you know we have over 800 species of bird in Australia? We're very, yeah. very fortunate indeed. And those birds come in all sorts of shapes, lots of sizes, and lots of beautiful colours, as the Aboriginal dreaming story in the beginning of the show mentioned. Each of those birds yeah, has a like unique ability, and that is what we'd like to demonstrate for you today. We're going to start it on a high note. She's an aerial specialist. above your head. These birds are magnificent. We also have a beautiful chicken. This is apricot chicken, everybody. It looks like she's gone the wrong way now. I am going to get my next one. I know you're the diva of the show, but I'm taking you to get me a slide all the time. I'll see if I can guide her in the right direction. Apricot's part, as you probably know, was to be one of those beautiful birds in the Aboriginal dreaming story, but it looks like she's lost her way. <laughs> All right, now I know apricot's just fascinating, but don't take your eyes off this amazing kite because she is really special as well. What is so memorable about these kites is the way that they hunt. You see, they're always on the lookout for a quick and easy meal. Hopefully it's not chicken. More likely she's going to go for something in the air. And here's Matthew to help apricot out. Let's see our beautiful whistling kite with some food. Are you ready, Dixie? Up it goes! Oh. 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 Caught by the lady in the audience. Thank you very much. Hey, you could be taken up by Dixie. She did not miss the trick. Let's give her another go. Are you ready, Dix? Here it comes. No. Can you imagine a whistling kite hunting a group of a swarm of locusts or insects? She quickly snatches that food up on the wing and then passes it straight to her beak without ever having to land. This is an incredibly efficient way of catching your food. It means she can fill up fast and keep on the move. As you can see, kites are incredibly cunning. They really are very good predators. And they're incredibly cosmopolitan too. Kites are one of the most widespread birds of prey in the world and if you'd like to see one out there in Australia, have a look where humans are making a living. They found out, worked out very, very quickly that people need food. <laughs> and so if you want to see a kite doing its stuff out there, have a look near a tip, a court, abattoirs, even a picnic ground. They're all great places to see these beautiful birds doing their stuff. Whoa, she really is the aerial acrobat of the sky as she takes off again on this wonderful gun today. <laughs> as I said, parts are very, very cunning, so she can work out a quicker way of getting food and she's going to do it. All right, Dixie, here we go. Nice catch. If you're enjoying seeing Dixie swooping and circling above your head, I know I definitely am. She's one of my favorites. Think about this. Kites hunt in large numbers. So if